Good morning, brothers and sisters. This is Danny from CatcherChrist.net, and today we're going to be memorizing 1 Thessalonians 1.6. As always, we'll be using the Scripture Typer Bible Memory System app that I highly recommend. Please see the first video on this playlist for a more in-depth tutorial on how I like to use this app. I'm going to skip ahead a little bit in the process. You'll go to My Verses, um, and you'll ordinarily add the verse to your library, but since it's already in my library, I'll just search. I'm sorry. First Thessalonians 1 6. And then we'll start the three step process. Now, when you're adding a verse to your library, you can choose from different translations. I'm using the NIV, but there's many other translations you can choose from. So, the first step is typing it. You're going to type the first letter of each word, and each word should change from gray to black. You became imitators of us and of the Lord, for you welcome the message mm -hmm. in the midst of of severe suffering with the joy given by the Holy Spirit. First Thessalonians 1 6. When you make a mistake, it'll buzz and um, turn red so you know you made a mistake. You'll do that step at least three times. Uh, the second step, um, you became imitators of us and of the Lord, for you welcomed the message of are in the midst of severe suffering with the joy given by the Holy Spirit. First Thessalonians 1 6. As you can see, the app takes away half the words and you're essentially filling in the blanks and you're still only typing the first letter of each word. And every other or every time, <clears throat> excuse me, you do the second step, it's going to take away the other half of the words. You see it alternates. So you do that step at least three times. And the last step, of course, you'll be typing it completely from uh, from memory. So you became imitators of us and of the Lord, for you welcome the message in the midst of severe suffering with the joy given by the Holy Spirit. 1 Thessalonians 1, six. Now, once you hit 100% accuracy, I always recommend that you try to get it at least two more times at 100%. I think that really goes a long way to helping you recall and retain the verse in the future. Also, I think it's really important to recite the verse as you're typing it. It's something about hearing your own voice um, really is beneficial. If you're anything like me, you're going to start to hear your own voice in your head. And lastly, it's always important to read verses in their original context. So for more information about First Thessalonians and the context of this verse, please see the link below in the description. Thank you for watching uh, this First Thessalonians 1-6 memorization tutorial. This is Danny from CatcherChrist.net. Have a great day. God bless.